I attended the personal and organization management training at MIMPRO, supported by AJWS. And during this training, uh, something that stood out for me was the effective use of the different life skills, the communication skills, the interpersonal skills, you know, working in harmony with others is what stood out for me and how best we use these skills to not only benefit our personal lives but also the professional setting you know the, the waking up every morning actually having a vision having a goal having a strategy on how you're going to go about life and how you're going to achieve the different things beginning with a small to-do list maybe for a day a daily schedule or maybe adjust a task list or list of going to the market buying groceries simple simple things that push you to do something that you have a vision for and later on when you're able to do things on a daily how am i planning out for my day what am i doing in the morning what am i doing when i come back from work you're able to mitigate that into your professional life where you're able to handle a project you know when they give you a project you have to have a vision you have to have a goal you have to have a purpose and all these you need to sit down be able to use your different skills to see that you achieve what you want to get out of this whole vision that you have what you want to be in maybe in the next 10 years what you want to be in the first years five next years what do you want to be even tomorrow yes it opened up that visionary mind it also highlighted on the issue of self-awareness this brought about the, the, the sort analysis you know being able to know your strength your threats your opportunities and your weaknesses yes on a personal basis i know i'm able to communicate effectively i'm able to find the right context to best suit the children because that's my passion uh, my professional world yes we are able to to know the different to assess you know you reach out to a community and you're able to assess what strength do they have as a community how best can i help them realize their potential so that they use it to acquire what they want without me necessarily giving them the right decision or giving them my own thoughts. I attended a feminist movement training here at Membro. That movement to me looked like something that everyone needs. For example, that group we were in, young ladies from different areas of work, different ages, some were in school, some are out of school. We were facilitated by different ladies and one i mostly remember was isabella she talked about a lot of things and some of the things i do remember in that training were how most of us tend to be submissive and complacent with the, the patriarchal society we are in for example in our schools in our homes even the places we dwell in we find that Oftentimes, it's men that are socialized into believing that they're brave, they're the breadwinners, they are superior to women. And we grew up thinking that, yes, that is what it's supposed to be. But during the training, we were given knowledge about how, as women, we need to take charge of our lives. We need to be empowered enough to make decisions. We need to have agency to work on our behalf. And that training was really impactful in a way that the knowledge that I gained has helped me in so many ways than one. And it does not necessarily have to be about patriarchy, matriarchy, but in uh, ways, for example, in my interactions with different people. Before, I used to believe that with the entitlement that most men had, that we needed to be fierce as well in order to counter it. But after the training, I've come to realize that people have different backgrounds, right? And their backgrounds inform their decisions and their behaviorism in society. So as an empowered person, I believe that now I can take people at their value, at what they have to offer. I can meet you 
where you are. So I believe that it has enabled me be a better communicator, be a better facilitator, and as well as being a better friend in my society and with my friend groups. And uh, during the training, the feminist movement, I learned that feminism is not necessarily about being volatile, about being mad at masculinity. It's also about how you feel as a person. How are you able to take your life and make your own decisions and be able to do the same with people around you? Building a movement is not necessarily going against the government, going against uh, challenging leadership, but it's also about understanding yourself, being self-aware, trying to start change on a personal level and then you start small you can talk to your friends to your circles and you don't necessarily have to be violent but you just have to change mindset really and it has been a great great thing to know because now i feel like my decisions are more informed i feel like i stand in a space and i'm able to voice my opinion and be proud of it and be confident enough to defend it and it has really affected my life in more ways than one